There aren't many circumstances where you're presented with a scenario that forces you to dig into your bag of tricks and utilize multiple applications all at once. Unless you have a $7 million bounty on your head and about half of Europe's population coming at your neck every second the opportunity presents itself. After all, there aren't repercussions for conducting business on a continental hotel premises. And it's not every day that you've been excommunicado when all you have is a hotel dormant for emotional support. But just in case there ever was a situation where you're against the world, you'll probably want to diversify your arsenal before the outcome turns out like Mr. Tony Montana and you find yourself landing face first in your own swimming pool. The HRT Rack Plate Carrier is a multiple layout system designed for multiple missions. This was an obvious choice to have a carrier on the channel of such universal capabilities given how fast the human's attention span is rapidly growing. Nowadays, we want shiny objects with gadgets that hook up to self-driving electric cars. Not saying that this plate carrier has a battery pack that can connect to your eco-friendly Prius, but who doesn't want a full foray of equipment that can engage targets for about 15 minutes of non-stop action while carrying a mini town hospital on your back? The HRT Rack's internal setup is like most play carriers, a two-piece front and back connection system for protection of the vital organs. There's cushion lining running along the inside for comfort. It's not tempur comfortable, so if you're expecting to take a bath and a tag with pronouns to come with it, then you're SOL. The shoulder straps also play a main role with the intro to your plate carrier setup. There's a quick release buckle on the operator's left side for emergency situations. And for all my comms guys, a Velcro wiring layout is constructed on both straps, and there is where you can run your communication devices, which would be a good time to talk about HRT's Molly Cumberbund. It's a base that supports your movement, but you can also adopt it as a host by taking advantage of the Molly webbin on the front side. I've connected two STEC 30 cal mag carriers to provide additional support, but you can add anything if it's mildly compatible. The front side of the rack is where you get to tap into your inner John Perlman, aka Lobo, and go full gunner mode, minus the modified PKM. HRT has adopted the Swift Clip Placard system, so you get the option to run multiple setups according to your personal preference. I'm running the Maximus card for a balance system that can give me medical, primary, and secondary options. I can also use the pouches in front for admin accessories as well. The mag inserts, also provided by HRT, are fabricated around Velcro, so this gives you the option to run other loads depending on your mission. You can find these options linked down in the description. Below I kept it conventional with three AR mag inserts because nowadays it's more common to run into an abandoned house with four Palmetto State 10.5 inch bills and a stockpile of 223 laying around, but with the way these gas prices are hidden, it might end up being subgun summer for the rest of the year, or shall I say Benelli season. Which reminds me, there is some Velcro molly webbing located right below the sternal notch, and if you're thinking what I'm thinking, yup. You can add a 5 round shell placard for door breaching duties, or you can keep it traditional and just wait around till the broadcast radio tells you to lock all your doors and stay quiet because, you know, spooky hours. Other additional items that I've acquired to the front of the play carrier are HRT's tourniquet pouch. It's a simple elastic velcro option that can be stacked underneath the Maximus placard for additional backup. On the back side is where you'll find the rack's bread and butter. It's an open face interlocking zipper system where you can plug and play according to your strengths. I've applied HRT's side pull medical tray for easy access, and also, who doesn't like the thought of stockpiling hemostatic agents for those gory moments? To all my SWAT medics out there, it's the perfect storage compartment for major IFACs and other medical items. The medical tray can be maneuvered by pulling either side of the handle depending on the operator's availability. It can be broken down into two separate compartments just in case you need to use them individually. But what sealed the deal for me is the medical pullout tray is accommodated with the user adjustable retention system. You can do so by adjusting the hook loop that holds the outer shell together. On the outside is Velcro Molly webbing, which gives you the option to use it as a building block for other Molly compatible items. Right above the medical tray are two GP pouches that can be used for secondary support. These can also be removed freely by HRT's interlocking system. This gives you additional real estate to add special items like smokes or extra batteries. And can you guess what I use the space for? Uh-huh. More medical. Statistics shows that you're more than likely to deploy medical equipment before any other defense mechanism in distress situations. The good news is that now you have more compartment options to carry first aid. The goal is to stay ahead of the curve, not below it. Oh wait, we already know that outcome. See what I did there? But again, personal choice is favorable. You can find several other back panel options on HRT Tactical's website, which I'll also have linked down in the description. Secret missions and dramatic scenarios aren't often compatible unless your loadout consists of utilizing universal applications. The word universal doesn't usually mean gunfights on motorcycles while assassins chasing you with swords. But just in case the situation arrives, the HRT Rack Play Carrier is one rugged tough SOB that can be an option for carrying the right amount of equipment for various operations. For more intel on the Rack's breakdown, as always, you can find sources linked down in the description. As for now, 
I'm going to wrap this video up. To watch more content like this in the future, click the subscribe button. To get instant updates for the latest Pew Pew content, click the bell notification icon as well, and I'll see you guys in the next video.